um, you know, part of what came up on the debate on the floor and what we've been talking about is the fact, you know, a lot of people keep pushing on this idea of like, well, if we do like the Defense Act, then aren't we just saying we're not following the laws of other states? But there have been so many periods of time in our history where there's been big questions where the country has struggled with. And there have been many times where we have not followed the laws of other states. You know, I think one of the big ones is why we had the Civil War. <laughs> um, you know, the Fugitive Slave Act, there were a number of states who weren't following that. Um, gay marriage is another one. You know, there were a number of states that were not um, respecting marriage licenses from states that did respect the fact that people could love who they loved and marry who they wanted. Um, you know, we see it also kind of in our voting rights. There's different voting laws in every state. You know, if you, if you move from Minnesota to somewhere else, you may not have access to, you know, same day registration, right? Or, so some of them we respect and some of them we don't based on kind of like, you know, what the public policies are of different states. And yeah, that's, that can be a question about like what this means for, you know, our country and how we, how we all work together. But at the same time, when a, when a court case like Dobbs comes down, it now is kind of throwing into question what it means to the right to travel around the country, the right to engage in commerce around the country. I think these are big questions that us as Americans are going to have to figure out how we want to do it. But what we know in Minnesota and in other states that are passing shield laws um, like Minnesota is that we want to protect our residents. We want to protect those who we know are doing what we, what we value, what we think is right, and how we can protect more people. And so that is the perspective we come from this. Everything that we've written in this bill is about what takes place in Minnesota. We're not, we're not like some of the other states. We're not trying to reach into other people and tell them what to do. But we're saying here in Minnesota, this is what we're going to do. And I think that that's important to remember when people are trying to have this conversation about what this means for the state of laws in our country.